So, sorry about the lighting, it's a little weird, but I've just finished my other vlog and now I'm gonna blow dry my hair. It's been sitting out, I brushed it out, I combed it out with this little brush here. I broke the handle off a long time ago, but yeah, fun fact, this is like from a friend where I used to live in Mississippi. This was her mom's hairbrush and she gave it to me and then I forgot to give it back. Like her, her, not her mom gave it to me, but my friend gave it to me, so yeah. I'm about to comb my hair out again and I'm going to blow dry it. I would like vlog it, but it's not going to be interesting. I'm going to try and use my round brush. Probably not going to happen. So yeah, I guess I don't really blow dry my hair often. So I haven't like figured out a way how to do it good. So I was going to um, show you guys, but you know, whatever. I also need heat protectant. I really don't have any, but like I really don't feel like going to get any. Um, I was but I was considering like going to like Walgreens just right of the street to get some. I don't feel like it. It's like almost seven o'clock and I'm just gonna risk it. I have a little bit, but I'm not gonna use it to blow dry my hair. I'm gonna use it to straighten it. Yeah. Okay, half of my hair is done. Still kind of wet, like in the roots a little bit, so I'll have to go back and do that. But I'm using this brush, instead of the round brush. It's a little hard to use a round brush on your own hair, but my hair is so big. But it was actually, when I took out like the wet part, it wasn't tangly and I was like, whoa. Wow, I was shocked. I look like a full on lion now. <laughs> but now I'm gonna split it down in the middle again and then I'm gonna straighten one half and straighten the other half. Yay! Okay, so I just got finished with my hair. Here is the finish look. It actually was faster than it normally takes, which is so weird, but it feels really healthy. The ends obviously need to get a trim, but is to here. Here, the lighting's really bad. It's like to here. I oh, hope the lighting's good. I don't know, but. Yeah, now I think I'm gonna go make some dinner. I think I'm gonna make chicken alfredo or just chicken, rice, and broccoli. I think chicken, rice, and broccoli are gonna be a good one. Sorry, I'm holding the camera. Chicken, rice, and broccoli sound good for tonight because it's really easy. And then tomorrow or some other day, I'll make a chicken alfredo. So I've eaten dinner and I got ready for bed. Now my hair is tied up and everything. But this is really interesting. I was looking in the mirror and my acne right here is like improving. Like it wasn't even there. And I, I'm blaming the rays. I'm blaming the rose water, but I'll probably do like a, a review on my channel. I know I don't really do makeup videos, but I think I'm gonna do one. Also, right now I'm about to go to bed and I'm watching YouTube videos. And I'm gonna try and edit my talk Tuesday because I'm uploading it probably tomorrow night. I had to upload it. I picked on my outfit for tomorrow. Tomorrow at school is a whole day of ACT workshop. So they haven't really informed us of much. So I don't know what's really going on. They just said go to the gym. And I don't, I'm like, okay, but they can't like do the, it's the whole junior class. They can't teach a whole junior class in just what in gym. So I'm really confused about that. Hey guys, so I don't think I vlogged yesterday about the ACT. I just forgot about it. But the ACT honestly wasn't that bad. It really wasn't hard. So if you guys took the ACT too, if you guys are a junior and you took it yesterday, which was Tuesday, it's February 28th. Um, if you guys took it too, let me know how you guys thought it went because for me, it wasn't that hard. It was pretty easy. Also, there's this thing called the Boys and Girls Club, which I can volunteer at and I've been wanting to do it. But I was so happy like when I signed up, I was like, oh, I can do it every day. And then, you know, I signed up and now I, I still feel like going. <laughs> so I'm going to try and go tomorrow because tomorrow I have band practice and it's from 6 to 8. And I don't feel like going all the way home. So I, and that school is right next to mine. So I can just go to that school, volunteer until 6 and then go to band. So I think that'll be really convenient. I probably will do that. Um, if I don't have a lot of homework, I don't think I should. I don't think I will. So yeah, that's what I'm probably going to do tomorrow. I don't know why I said it like that. <laughs> and then um, I picked up the vlog camera because my hair is so cute. I wanted to show you guys that. I did two little like Dutch braids into pigtails and I wrapped my hair around the hair tie. Love it. If you guys want a tutorial on my main channel, will do. But um, yeah. I picked up my vlog camera for some specific reason, and I can't remember why. I'm trying to think, but I, I, I don't remember. I really have no idea, but if I remember, I'll, I'll, I will tell y'all. Guys, what's up? My stomach, every time I like talk, my stomach starts to hurt, but I'm so sad because I filmed my video for this week, last week, and I just don't like it. Because it's just, I don't like it. The lighting, it was too dark the day I filmed it, so the background isn't bright at all. And 
it's just like really dull so I think I'm gonna refilm it I'm pretty sure I really need to purchase softbox lights because I'm realizing that it's not becoming okay to just use natural lighting so I'm pretty sure I'm gonna purchase softbox lights pretty soon currently though 746 after school I went to Starbucks I was we we're gonna go to a snowball or slow cone place but um because they opened on Wednesday and I was so excited but then Dion figured out he loved Starbucks and he figured out that Starbucks had buy one get one free macchiatos and so we went there instead. Also I was brainstorming ideas and I figured out what I wanted to do for my March Talk Tuesday which is so funny but I just want to do a video like every Tuesday when I talk to you and it doesn't have to be a life update so for March Talk Tuesday I'm going to be doing a 10 things that you can do to be happy and I've already had a list and I'm planning on like filming me doing all of those things so it's going to be a long process so that's why I'm planning on starting now and also um I have a I want to do a room tour because my room isn't how I want it but I know it's not going to get to how I want it for a while so I think that's another March video I want to do I have a spring vac break video I think I'm doing this month I have my planner I should probably write in here my ideas before I forget about them let me tell you guys something whenever I'm planning my videos I get so into it so I literally just planned all my April videos except for my talk Tuesday and my last week of that month and then I planned all my March videos so I'm super excited for that coming upcoming next two months it's hard to plan videos because I don't really know what I'm doing so I try to plan it around what I'm doing so like for instance in April spring break is I think April uh, I don't know um it's like in between April 3rd and April 22nd in between there that's very broad, but it's the week after April 3rd. I know that because April 3rd is Dion's birthday, and I know Summer Break is after his birthday. So, yeah. So, I have um, a, after that week, I have a week in my life for, I don't know why I said it like that. A week in my life of my spring break, so I'm going to do like a vlog, and I'm going to vlog my um, spring break, whether I do go to the beach or I stay home. Hopefully, it'll be exciting to vlog. So here I have like March videos, and then I try to be cute and like write in cursive, but like I really don't know how to write a V in cursive, or a lot of letters in cursive, I don't know how. I don't know why it's not focusing. Curly hair girl problems. I just wrote like this, and then I realized that um, a spring break idea was I was going to have to film next weekend, and that wasn't going to happen by then, and I want to put effort into it, so I switched it with my room tour. Give me one to do curly hair routine, and then someone asked me if I can do like a makeup review on Milani. I was like, if you will do, I will totally do that, but... It's gonna be like a month later, so I'm sorry. It's just like planning videos is like really hard, and I want to do all the videos I want to do. So yeah, um, yeah. <laughs> hey guys, so today I think it's gonna be pretty much a chill day. I was gonna go um, hang out with Dion, and we we're gonna go see Get Out because I'm super excited to see that. But he's at his dad's house, and he's going to like some basketball thing. I don't really know, so I'm not doing that today. So today I'm gonna be filming and right now I'm putting my blanket on because I'm cold but I'm about to do my makeup for my video. I'm filming today a um hairstyle video for spring like spring hairstyles. I think I told you guys this last night and I already filmed my video for today. It's uploading right now. Um so yeah I think I'm gonna curl my hair. Like do some like straightener curls, I don't know. Um but I'll vlog I look so pale. <laughs> I think this is the only time my lighting looks good though so i'm gonna vlog when my makeup's on i don't know what i'm gonna do i should do like a chit chat get ready with me in my vlog channel i really enjoy doing those but i feel like i'm gonna watch youtube well but i want to watch youtube videos and i also i don't really know what i want to do and also i think this video is pretty long already so i'm not gonna do that but yeah that's what's gonna happen i just wash my face because yeah and I'm also making ramen. I boiled some water. I'm boiling water right now to make ramen because I'm starving and I haven't ate anything. And it's almost 12 o'clock, I think. Let me see what time it is. It's currently 1.07. It's already 12. It's past 12. Oh, my God. So I think I'm going to film half the styles today, half them tomorrow. And I think that sounds like a good game plan. Update. I, am, I forgot about my water boiling now. I just took a break to eat. And I am baking. I don't bake often. But I contoured and I put bake right here. I've seen people do that on YouTube. And then I also do manderize like um, normal people do. And now I think I'm gonna just wait because I can't do anything else when this is happening. It's too much. So, yeah. 
Well, this happened. I don't even know what time it is. It's currently 1.57, so I've been doing this for a bit. Um, I just, like, got glam. I'm more glam. I'm not sure if you can tell, but, like, it's there. It's definitely, like, a lot of makeup, but I really like it. So, I used my Smashbox Double Exposure, and I used the colors. Let me see what the colors are called. I think I used the colors Fig and Temper. Colors Fig and Temper. Temper on my outer corner as well as Expressa which is just a brown and then I put on like a shimmery color from the Carly Bible palette and then I highlighted my brows and I filled in my brows and I put the fig and temper under my eye lash line as well and the bronzer man the um baking made it look so good and then I'm gonna do my lips make them look whatever I don't know I think I'm gonna do a nude since my eye makeup is so bold and then I'm gonna curl my hair and I'm gonna film some hair styles seen of you guys but like, you look the best when you're not going anywhere great <laughs> and too well for me i'm now curling my hair with my straightener and my curls never look this good so i just did this one this one looks the best right now here i'll show you guys how uh, or not okay let me try to make this taller i'm not sure i think you can see most of it so what i do sorry this is an ad i'm taking a tiny section like this just brush it out then you want to take your straightener. If you put your straightener on and you go up, that's away from your face. If you go down, that's toward your face. So this one, they go away. So I just start and I straighten the beginning for a second. And then I just twist it. Oh, that hair for down. I just twist it a bit. And I try and go pretty slow, but don't go too slow where you're burning your hair. And then I hold the ends. And once I get, it doesn't matter if you pull it away from your face or down or whatever. Once I get to the ends, I just kind of let go. And then it's gonna shape into its curl, kind of goes there by itself. And there's that. Let me pin this back up and do another one for you guys since it fell. Okay, so I'll do another one. This one I'll do um, toward my face. I'm just doing like alternating so I can get like pretty waves, I guess. I don't want it to all go in one clump, but. I'm leaving the ends out so that when it falls, it like still looks really natural. And so I'm just kind of curling the middle section, if you guess, but more toward the top of the middle. So again, straighten the beginning for a second. Then towards your face, you want to go down. And you can also go down like this, or you can go straight out. It's just easier. It depends. Whatever one's easy for you. So I'm going pretty slow again. It smells like it's burning. It smells like it's burning. Just go a little faster. And it's kind of hard. You want to close it pretty tight. And once the ends are right there. There we go. There's that one. And I'll just finish this one for you guys. And this one I'll do away. I like doing like the ones closest to my face away. What the heck? This one's like intertwined. What the heck? I'm like confused. Okay. Okay, there we go. So the ones closest to my face I like doing away because if you have curls going toward your face, it's really weird. So again, we'll do that. And once you get the hang of it, you can probably do it really faster. Then curling with the curling iron. I was going to get my curling iron out and curl some with the curling iron and some with the straightener. But honestly, <coughs> sorry, there is um, this, <coughs> the straightener is spelling. Um, here's the side. It's just faster to do it with a curler. I mean, it's just faster to do it with a straightener. So definitely recommend learning how to do this, but that's what I'm doing right now. Very sweet. I'm done with curling my hair. Um, when I straighten my hair, my straightener makes it the worst smell. So like, <coughs> it's on my throat. But here it is. It's kind of Selena Gomez esque. I feel if I had bangs, it would be like totally her era. I don't know, but when she had bangs, but it's very loose. I tease my roots because my hair is looking a little flat. But I need like some dry shampoo to add some. Well, I don't own any, any. But yeah. Now I'm gonna film, I'm gonna try and film hairstyles that won't mess this up, so I have a couple of- <coughs> Oh my god, I can't stand that smell. I have a couple that shouldn't mess up my curls, so I'm gonna do those two first. So I just finished filming, I think my last hairstyle, I have another one that I want to film, but I'm not filming it today, so I filmed four hairstyles I did, you guys will see, I'm not, I can't explain them, but they will be in my- Next week's main channel video, I think I'm going to upload this video this weekend, this vlog, so yeah. Let's check out my video. Oh, it's uploaded! Yes, okay, I need to make a thumbnail, which I haven't done yet, and then I will upload it, so. Yeah. Hey guys, so I don't really have anything else planned for the rest of the weekend. I really have very lame weekends. Um, 
I just don't, I don't really want to continue this vlog and just drag it out when I'm not doing anything. Like, honestly, I'm so bad and I, I just don't vlog whenever I'm with other people, which is really annoying. So I'm going to try and do better and hopefully next weekend. Um, I always talk about Dean. I realize that in my vlogs and I honestly, half the time I talk about him, I just cut it out because it's too much and it doesn't matter. But next weekend, I'm not sure if Dion can, but I've asked him and he said he'll see um, if he has like, time. But next weekend, I need to film. So I asked him if he can help me film and he said, yeah, sure, but if he has time. So I think I'm going to film my room tour next weekend with him if he can. And then also I may film some stuff for my What to Do Over Spring Break and my march talk tuesday if he comes if he doesn't come then most of the stuff i have to film someone else has to film it for me so then i just won't film and my camera's died so that's an indicator that i need to stop vlogging so i'll see you guys next time bye guys <laughs>